Well, it's uh, 2011 and spring has sprung. So it's the beginning of April here, which means we're about two weeks from our last frost date. And I just wanted to give everybody a quick update on how things are turning along in the aquaponics. So this is the bucket system, as you can see. I have uh, some spring onions in here, and this is why they're called spring onions, I guess. You can see I've already harvested some. Uh, these, ju these just came from the store, actually. You know, I bought some, some onions and then, you know, chopped them up. Took the, the root ends and put them in the gravel here, and they grow just fine. And, you know, it's an easy way to get some onions if, um, if you like them. Over on the other side, we have a couple seedlings. I think I put some beets in here, and I uh, don't even remember exactly what else. But they're just starting to pop up. A few of them might have a true leaf or two. On the, uh, on the pipe system, we've got a couple little sprouts. Let's see if we can zoom in there. Now these guys are uh, just in net pots with a piece of mop, round mop, that is wicking up into the, into, the, uh, into the soil. What's been surprising to me is how poorly the soil has taken up the moisture. So we're going to have to see what we can do about that. A, a reader over at the Primal Prepper had, had suggested tearing up a, uh, a microfiber cloth, which might be a little experiment to do because this is really just not uh, not cutting it. Fish are good. Let's see if we can take a look down in there. Maybe give them a little bit of food, they'll come up to the surface. The guys in the big tank are doing well. There you can see they're ready to eat. There they come. They'll come up for food. And that's about it. So, you know, happy 2011. Get yourself gardening.